Santa Clara University has a new president, and the school has never had one like her before. Yesterday, the 171-year-old Catholic institution inaugurated its first woman president. Dr. Julie Sullivan can also claim another first for the university. She's the first lay person to lead the Catholic campus. I bring people together who make my little seed of an idea a huge success. So I look forward to bringing the great minds in this community together to dream and do some wonderful things. It takes courage to become the first lay person and first woman president of Santa Clara. She will be the rising tide that lifts all ships around her, and most importantly, the ship that is Santa Clara University. This generation cares immensely about our world and its challenges. I believe they can become the citizens and leaders of competence, conscience, and compassion. Ethical citizens and leaders who have the knowledge and faith to create a more humane, just, and sustainable world. And our mission is to educate and inspire them, to help form them into men and women for and with others, and to help them discern God's calling for their lives. As a community of scholar-servant leaders, Santa Clara joins in the broader task of expanding human knowledge, deepening human understanding, exploring human faiths, and serving those in great need. May your work, Dr. Sullivan, and the work of Santa Clara University continue to lift up Christ and his gospel of hope and joy as a beacon of dignity and progress for humanity. Educating the whole person, mind, body, and soul, is the historic legacy of a Jesuit education at Santa Clara University. Madam President, you've got a big responsibility, but I want to assure you, you will not be alone. After all, you're a Bronco now. <laughs>